here it is. I still owe you the butter video. I couldn't finish before I left the UK. So it says that you need to soak the butter mold in cold water. Pouring the cream into the butter churner, but it mustn't get too full. And here I can tell you already now, as lovely as it looks, I wouldn't buy it again because you can see that the lid is only holding to the glass with these two clips rather than screwing the top onto it. Here you can see that the lid doesn't have a firm grip on the jar. It would be so much better if it would be screwed onto it. And uh, yeah, it just gets a bit more difficult once the cream starts to thicken. You can obviously use this buttermilk for any other uses. Now prepare a bowl of cold water and also add some ice. Squeeze all the remaining milk out of it and wash it in ice cold water and keep squeezing it. Fortunately, I only have one mould, so I'm going to make a block out of the remaining butter. Now it goes into the fridge. And here I must say I struggled a bit to get it out. Well, to get it out in a nice way.
Yes, it's lots of work, but I can tell you it was delicious. 